Hi and welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking into this video. So today I'm going to teach you how to fix the not enough buyers for products on your city skylines. So there are a handful of different actions you can take to deal with the city skylines not enough buyers for products problem as they are as follow so what you can do is play around with your zoning for industry and commercial increase your exports and improve your intercity connections so it is about creating a general balance between your industry what your industry is creating and where it can be sent to so even if you don't have enough commercial zoning in your city there is always going to be somewhere to send your products if you look around hard enough so the play around with your zoning for industry and commercial the most obvious thing that you can do to deal with the city skylines not enough buyers for products problem is to decrease your industry or to increase your commercial zoning so this is a more head-on approach to the supply and demand issue by either decreasing the amount of the products being supplied or increasing the demand for for the said products so we do you do have to be very careful to not go too far in other direction though so as they can easily mean that you end up with the not enough goods to sell problem so it is better to approach it in increments and slowly tweak the amounts bit by bit and it is also generally better to favor increasing your commercial zoning over decreasing your industry as this will n not only bring you more money and make your citizens happier but also prevent the loss of taxes by removing pre-existing industry buildings so next increase your exports so what you can do however if you don't have the demand to increase commercial zoning in your own city is to send it elsewhere so it can always be someone else's problem right so exports are excellent tool to get rid of excess products though so while making a potentially large sum so large sum of money as well so if you put enough of a focus on exports you can actually position to become the supplier to the rest of the world you will of course need to build the correct infrastructure to be able to export goods however however so building cargo outsourcing the links like trains and ferries is essential if you want to keep up with the amount of produce you are creating and furthermore having an efficient way for general industry traffic to get out of your city can also be a real help as it is useless if they need to go through your entire residential zones to reach the main roads to exportsville exportville and then lastly is to improve your intercity connections so it might seem rather silly but the last thing you can do to deal with the city skylines not enough buyers for products problem is to improve your intercity connection so after all your products might not actually be able to get to the demand so there are few moments in city skylines where you feel st stupider than re re realizing that you have forgotten to connect your fancy new district to the rest of your city. So living it isolated and frustratingly untouched, this is the case for your industry too as the most important thing is actually having a route for imports and exports to actually take. So otherwise the goods will just sit there with no one to pick them up. And that is all for this video and I hope this helped you. And if it did, please make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click the notification bell button so you won't miss a video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great one. Bye-bye.